and NDSU is through to the quarterfinals. We go to the Fargo Dome and check in with Valley News Live Sports Director Beth Hool. Beth? Yeah, Alex, really a dominating win for NDSU over Montana State today. Jumping off the stat sheet for me, well, it had to be that run game. Over 400 yards of rushing for the Bison today and three different running backs, each logging over 100 yards each. They knew it was going to be a tougher game for us to throw the football because they play so deep with their secondary. Um, and I wouldn't know if that was how they were going to still try to play us or if they were going to bring those guys up. And they didn't. They kept them back. So we were able to, to rush the football uh, and get to that second level. I felt like it was a lot of creases. Um, like I said, you know, they did a great job blocking. And, you know, when they do that and I see the hole, I'm, I'm going to hit it. I'm going to hit it hard. You know, we had a really great first quarter. And. You can kind of forget, not forget about all the, the stuff they do, but you can kind of settle in and um, understand that, hey, we're prepared for their movements, the different fronts and things like that, and, um, you know, just just start rolling like we did. Obviously, not, not the way we wanted to start. Uh, we, we blew a, a coverage or blew a pressure and, and cut a guy loose, and uh, they did a nice job of finding him in the same respect. Uh, our defense did a great job of, of holding them to three there. Well, I think was, what was important was, you know, we had a miscommunication on that first play and getting that talked through and, and shirt up. And then I think we had a lot of momentum going. Uh, we were down 3-0, but I think that um, we had a lot of momentum after that stop, and that was big for our offense and, and just big for our team. The Bison picking up some great rest in that bye week with the first round looking real fresh after this game. Coach Kleiman saying they came out fairly healthy from this one as they look forward to their quarterfinal matchup with Colgate next Saturday here at the Fargo Dome. Reporting with the Bison, Beth Hool, Valley News Live Sports. All right, thank you very much, Beth. Join us tomorrow morning for the Bison football show at 1030 on KX4. Coach Kleiman and Jeremy Jorgensen take a look back at this one and a look ahead at the quarterfinals. The Bison will host Colgate, Colgate in the quarterfinals. The Raiders with a field goal as time expired to beat James Madison. That game will be Saturday at 11 a.m. on ESPN. On the bottom half of the Bison bracket, South Dakota State wins easily over a, in a blizzard over Duquesne, 51-6. The Jacks will head to Atlanta to take on Kennesaw State in the quarterfinals. The Owls downing Wofford 13-10.